Hi everyone, my name's Angela Klein. I'm 17 years old and I go to school at Gloucester County Institute of Technology and I'm also a lifeguard. Um, in my future, I hope to have my own company and have a big family. And the National Honor Society is collaborating with United Way of Gloucester County just so I can read you If You Give a Cat a Cupcake by Laura Numeroff. If you give a cat a cupcake, he'll ask for some sprinkles to go with it. When you give him the sprinkles, he might spill them all over the floor. Cleaning up will make him hot, so you have to give him a bathing suit. and take him to the beach. He'll wanna go in the water. And build a sandcastle too. Then he'll look for seashells. He'll find a few other things as well. He'll put them in his pail and try to pick it up, but it'll be too heavy. He'll decide he needs to work out at the gym. First, he'll warm up on the treadmill and then he'll lift a weight or two. He might even try karate class. After the gym, he'll want to go to the park. When you get there, he'll see the rocks. He'll climb as high as he can go. At the top, he'll see a lake. He'll want you to take him rowing. He'll be the captain and you will have to row. Then he'll notice the merry-go-round and want to go for a ride. He'll want you to go for a ride too. You'll choose the horse with the purple mane and he'll get on the whale. The whale will remind him of the science museum. He'll ask you to take him there. First, he'll find the dinosaurs. Then, he'll visit the Hall of Apes. When the museum closes, you'll be the last to leave. On the way home, you'll pass by the beach. You'll help him gather all of his things. Then he'll want to race you. When you get home, he'll empty the sand from his shoes. He might spill some on the floor. Seeing the sand on the floor will remind him of the sprinkles. He'll probably ask you for some.
And chances are, if you give him some sprinkles, he'll want a cupcake to go with them. The end. So, um, my, my main story for that book, the main message behind it is responsibility and being responsible for everything. Um, and my connection with this book is that when I was younger, this was my favorite book to read. So, thank you.